People, my people, what you have before you are the three essential ingredients to a sidecar. Now, my philosophy, in case you haven't read it in the write-up for the uh, playlist, is if you're going to go and shell out $25 in a bar for a cocktail, you're shelling out for something that looks really good. On the other hand, if you're like me, and you've got an incredibly hectic life, and you've got three really loud, pain in the ass kids, and at the end of the day, you've got a choice of making up something that is delicious and stops you from stabbing people, but perhaps looks a bit like shit, then the choice is that you make the cocktail that looks like shit, but stops you from stabbing people. So the cocktail that will stop you from stabbing people tonight is actually a sidecar. Yep. So what I'm going to do is I've got the rum rum from Jimmy Rum. So you can run run to the rum rum. Otherwise, the rum rum will just run. So I'm going to give you the sound of happiness. I'm going to pour... Yeah, screw it. My darling wife came home today telling me that if I gave her alcohol, she'd start stabbing random people in the street. So I'm going to give her two shots of the rum rum, and that's 50% alcohol. It smells delicious, by the way. If I could have smell a smell of vision, I damn well would. I don't, so you're missing out on smelling Jimmy Rum's rum rum, which is just divine on the nose in a warm house. Now there is a lemon because the lemon will peach in the art later. We have Cointreau, which is our French contribution to the equation. No sound of happiness. Cointreau does screw tops. I'm going to tip in a shot of Cointreau. I'm going to put some lemon juice, which I actually peeled myself without managing to cut myself. So some lemon peel on the side. Next squirt, I'll drop it in. Who does sophisticated? I don't do words I can't spell. So that just rules me out. And then because this is full of eyes, I'm going to give this sucker a stir. Yep, so you can tell that I'm an engineer at heart and I'm a highly intelligent person. You go believe in the last one and I've got a couple of nice bridges to go selling you. So I want to see what the sidecar tastes like. The last time I was in a sidecar it was a hatch door bike. So uh, Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, if you love your citrus, then this one just hits you not like a sidecar, it hits you like a Mack truck or a freight train. This is really very big on the citrus. Um, and I'm reasonably certain I've got the recipe right. One moment. You wouldn't believe this, but I actually got the recipe wrong. I'm missing an essential ingredient. I knew the lemon was brought out for a reason. Okay, this is the essential ingredient. There is a shoot ton of lemon juice is about to be tipped into this baby. So it is really big on the citrus. Those of you who like citrus, who I name I shall not mention, like Selena, um, absolutely adore this stuff. You can see how I'm just macerating, just destroying the um, lemon off my own tree. Good. Southeastern Melbourne lemons died for this baby. Let's give her another stir and see what five or six minutes of me tracking down the proper recipe uh, will do plus the lemon juice. Um, yeah, I'm actually looking at the recipe now and yep, it's saying, well, oh, cognac, okay. I don't have any cognac in the house at the moment, but um, it does just as well with rum. Oh yeah, that certainly works really well. Hang on. Amazing, that's interesting. Okay, she who uh, finances my channel and must be obeyed therefore, says that she really likes it because it's intensely sour, it's got face pucker. And um, she just put away that sharp knife that she had sitting on the table. So 
this is the sort of cocktail that it doesn't look terribly good but it is going to stop you from stabbing people Jimmy Rum's Rum Rum or Cognac if you want to go following the um, recipe on thicker.com Cointreau, so the French influence and um, lemons simple cocktails for simple people from a simple person go out, make one today and remember to go and get Jimmy's because, well, Odin sent you. Get you around for some more stunningly easy, if not ugly, recipes for cocktails. Like, subscribe, share, do everyone a favour. Hit the button. Bye.